Hello folks, this has gone a spy. The spy will come to you live online for Star um sorry. <laughs> sorry. Um Transformers the gaming series. Uh, yeah, it's it's getting a little bit sleepy over here, but I'm getting full pump up energy for this next episode here because of the energy drinks I've been having. So um after from the last episode of dealing with the sumo challenge, which, to be told, I was a little bit boggling on the mind, struggling of how to deal with that challenge. I almost thought that it was not exactly an easy thing to do, but as it turns out, <laughs> I already know how to deal with it all along. How silly is that? Now, the... Now, after that challenge, Ironhide was able to make sure the All Sparks, Sam and Michaela and Bumblebee were safe. But then, uh, shortly after that, uh, Jazz uh, has spotted an explosion that hit downtown. So, before we get to that, we're going to deal with another challenge, one that's going to be a lot more fun uh, than uh, than the other last challenge. So. Jazz and I have already scouted up 40 cubes, so we're taking this challenge and then going on with the next uh, mission. Alright. And no bonus icons, just to let you guys know. Um, killing uh, all enemies and attack okay straight up let's do it I know how to do Kung Fu. Now, Jazz is not Bumblebee, but he can sure as hell take the rest of you, uh, Mel assholes. Here, have an ambulance. That way it'll send you to the hospital. Thank you. I will use this tank wisely. And as for tanks, you consider yourself tanked. Yeah, that was actually a lot more fun. A good warm up too for wherever it is that hit downtown. So Jazz. Let's go wrap it up.
Hey. Starscream? Look, <laughs> Starscream, just because that, <laughs> that uh, Jazz is a lot smaller than you and frankly with the rest of his Autobot comrades, doesn't mean that he's not exactly dangerous. He's a freaking lieutenant for Christ's sake. You think he get that permission, that a promotion for shits and giggles? Nah, dude. All right. Um, objective: ground star scream and defeat him. Uh, unfriendly skies. Uh, ominous. Star scream is after the all spark. Shoot him out of the sky to bring him down to your level. Then use any means necessary to keep him grounded permanently. Be so basically find a way to um. Alrighty, let's do this. And I'm going to need to go high ropes here. How you like that? Hula! Catch! Have a taxi? What the? Huh. That Decepticon... That behaves like a jet. Hey, take a bus. Oh yeah, owned. What the? <laughs> yes. Huh? What the? Oh, please don't tell me. For God's sakes. Crying out loud, another Decepticon uh, that acts like a freaking transportation military. What's next? A freaking tank? Oh, better yet, a freaking juggernaut forklift hell carrier? Whatever. Like I said before.
Bigger isn't always better. And we're going to show you the rightness uh, of what uh, the Autobots are truly capable of. And better yet. Oorah! Oh, will we will? How you like this? Try chapter. Got a little bit. Let's try this again. Down to planet Earth and the, and the, the cybernetics of Cybertron, and here's some rapid punishment of the jazz.
How you like that, Blackout? Yeah, and after I, we get done with you, uh, drone, and we're going to come after your b house too. By the way, flamethrower is so last year. I'll start with you, Starscream. Have some of this. One down, one to go. And your next blackout. You ready for some rapid jazz? I told you, this is uh, how Autobots Righteousness shows, uh, including humanity. We'll never let you uh, get the Allspark and destroy the planet we love so dearly, like you destroyed your own just for chaos and tyranny. And that is how we teach it into class, kids. Whew. Airway, Autobot, Jazz, skies are clear. <laughs> yeah. Uh, crap. Shit, shit. 
A tank to Subdecon? Okay, I'm I just lost it. We will. Alright. Folks, I'm going to put a stop to here to add these messages, folks. So this has gone by the spy offline until next time.